world famous sausage that apparently the recipe is uh, under 24 hour guard. A guy stands over the recipe and uh, guards it because it's that good. Today on In the Wood Yard, it's a delivery day. We got people who want wood and I'm gonna take it to them. Here we go. So on yesterday's video, you saw that we had the big crew of uh, six guys and we cleared out a lot of wood yesterday. I don't know how many loads we took. It was a bunch and we took a bunch of pallets and got a lot of stuff moved out to the farm. Still got lots to go, but a lot of it now is clean up stuff, a lot of pallets, things like that. And I'm gonna do some of that today. But first, I have some orders that I have to deliver. The first one is for a face cord or third of a cord of mixed hardwood. And they also said they wanted some locusts because they usually get oak and they really like that. And I said, hey, I've got some locusts. So there just happens to be a little bit here. I got a little bit of locusts right here, a little bit right there. And there's a little bit of oak right there that I'm gonna throw in. And then we're gonna go over the mixed hardwood and we're gonna put that in. So it's two face cords total. So we're gonna load that up and go deliver it. And then I got another delivery, I think two more after that. And then maybe some, somebody's gonna be coming to pick up some cookies today too. So I gotta get busy. There it is, boys and girls, a load of wood. It's two face cords or two thirds of a cord, if that's how you like to say it. Mostly in the beginning, I had a little bit of oak and then I had a lot of locust. That was the stuff in the middle I threw in there because they said they wanted that because they really like oak. And I told them, I said, I only had just a tiny little bit and I'd bring that. And then they said, whatever else sounds good. And they said, mixed stuff is fine. But I had a bunch of cherry left over from yesterday's haul that didn't get mowed. So I put the rest of that in. So there's more than two face cords in here. There's probably, I don't know. It's more than it's supposed to be, but they'll be happy. So down the road we go. back in the wood yard and my next delivery is for one face cord or one third of a cord of mixed hardwood. I got some right here so we're going to chuck it in we're going to go deliver this load and I just got a text I got one more order for later today and I got a guy coming to buy some cookies so wood's leaving what's left of the wood there's not a lot here but I got more going. Chucking time. There it is, wood in the truck. Face cord, third of a cord, going down the road. Gonna go do a dump.
Well, I'm back for my delivery and this guy showed up. This is Alan. He works right down the road, right? Yes, I do. And he wants some cookies and some chunks because you have a wood stove. Wood stove in my shop and in my house. And then uh, you burn just whatever you can get usually? Cheaper the better. If I can get it for free, <laughs> free good is one. good. Free we'll is make, good. We'll make her good. So he's got a couple totes here we're going to fill up, and then he's got a couple more he's going to come back. And do you have a way to unload these? Yes, I have a skid steer. Oh, yeah, so he can just scoop them right off and come back and do it again. So we're going to try to fill it up so that we get a full cord, basically, which I'm sure if we really heap it up, we can do that. So cookies are going to be leaving. So here we go. We're chucking. Mm -hmm. So there's another load in the uh, truck ready to be delivered. Uh, Bert came, stopped in, uh, dropped me off some world famous sausage that apparently the recipe is uh, under 24 hour guard. A guy stands over the recipe and uh, guards it because it's that good. And uh, so this is going to be like a good meal for me right here. And we got the wood loaded up. I'm going to go deliver that in Oshkosh. And then Alan just left. We loaded up his trailer is two totes for the second load he came and got so he's got four totes full probably a whole nother tote we threw a bunch of extra stuff in there too so the cookie pile is disappearing pretty quick which is nice and then later in the week I'm going to take a bunch of that and it's going to go down to Logger Al I'm going to drop that off for him and then um, Adam's coming the guy who helps us move out a friend of Bert's and friend of mine now too that helps us move a lot of stuff and do a lot of work here he's going to come get a load because that's going to be his payment for helping me so he's going to come get some so the cookies are going to pretty much be gone by the end of the week which is awesome so we're going to go deliver this load <music> Once again, I have returned to the wood yard and it got dark. It does that a lot this time of year. Coming up on the shortest day of the year, don't like it. I want more daylight. If you can do something about that, let me know. I'd like more daylight so I can do more work. That's it for today, folks. Poke the buttons. I'll be back tomorrow, first thing, 5.30 a.m. with another video for you tomorrow. We're gonna move some pallets out to the farm. That's my plan. And I think I got a delivery or two. So see you tomorrow. Good night, Irene. Mm -hmm.